The benefits of a roundabout are well known in their ability to reduce crashes and with a compact roundabout what we're looking for is to try and achieve those same benefits at a lower cost. The reason that compact roundabouts are able to provide crash reduction at a lower cost than a standard roundabout is that they take up less space and often allow you to work within the existing intersection footprints. So some of the key design elements when you're designing a compact roundabout are that your central island size is going to be quite different to if you were designing a full size roundabout. Um, you also have to think about the splitter islands which are going to look quite different to if you were designing a roundabout with reverse curves. In the context of comp compact roundabout we tend to use speed platforms in place of uh, reverse curves in order to reduce vehicle speed. You need to be aware that you're working in a smaller intersection footprint um, and as a result your heavy vehicle swept paths will be impacted. The solution to that is that you use a smaller central island, you have a concrete apron that allows your heavy vehicles to get around um, while still pushing your passenger vehicles out to the side and getting the correct angles that you want. Your lighting design will also be impacted when you're using a small central island. You need to be aware that it's a very new treatment and your solution needs to be very uh, situation specific. You need to make sure that you're thinking about all the different design elements that come along with that, all your drainage, your slope and, and everything else. Because compact roundabouts are more cost efficient than standard roundabouts, they provide an opportunity for more intersections to be treated and more lives to be saved.